Hey everybody, this is Alpha Zero at your service in the morning time, which is like 10 or 10, 10 or 7 or where I'm at. I'm gonna do a review on a new episode of Akatsuki no Yona, which is episode 15. Now, for this episode, I believe like um it seems to be alright in a sense, but for some reason it's kind of bothering me a bit. Well, there's only one thing that's been bothering me, but it's nothing much of a big deal. But if anything else, I'd like to get started right away. Okay, at the beginning, we see to it that our our group Yona, Hawk, Yoon, Kija, and Shinya are like traveling around to try to find the Green Dragon. However, like um, even though like um, thanks to like um, to a certain exterior, we have like um, one of our friend. Of course, we have one of our friends like um, having the most trouble having most trouble trying to find. Um, the green dragon, but even with Shinya's um, eyes, they can at least go around and look look around. They come back to a village which is like plagued with disease, like what happened with you, like what happened with Yoon's village. You know, it was devastating and horrible. So by that time, as the episode progress, as the episode progressed with every, as the episode progressed, we see to it that we see to it that an old man. Is actually die is about to die out, but thanks to Yoon and Yona's like kindness, that he helped he they helped him out, and he says like um that the second king the king the king the second was a horrible king. He couldn't save us or something. He, all he did was just like maybe left things in the peril or something, which was pretty much to my surprise because I never see anyone like smack talk like about that about him. But if that's true, then. I guess I can't handle that fact or something. This hurt Yona really badly, and she says she has to hit the toilet or something, or go to the bathroom. But she's just wanting to cry like so hard, and that's when the hog explains to the rest of them like um about the past of him being a uh, about being with the king and so forth. But he says he never serves a king that's a fool, and that's a good thing because if Hawk was serving a king as a if he was serving a foolish king, then he pretty much would have left right away and wouldn't give a wouldn't, wouldn't give two. Sh it's about it's about them, you know, and that pretty much got me like, well, that it is what it is, you know. I mean, like, life has a way of biting you right in the butt. <laughs> That's one thing I learned. And as we see to it, when everyone's resting, Yona's like practicing using her bow and arrow, and then her father's words came to her, and sa he says, "You are not allowed to wield a weapon at all, okay." That's all I can tell you. And she ends up crying so hard because of what her father said to her. And I'm pretty sure there's more to a reason to that because, like, um, she is pretty much that. I'm not really sure. No, that is her fa only father she ever had. The only thing that's concerning me right now is like, what happened to the mother? Uh, she might. I, all I know is like, if she have died or something, I would like to know what she looks like exactly. You know? You guys know what I'm getting at? Then the rest of the episode picks off with like um our 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 antagonist here known to be Su Wong. In other words, like um pretty much to me he's pretty much like um bothering me in this episode because he seems like relaxing, going sightseeing with the cut with in the Earth Clan, and the general of the Earth Clan seems to be bothered a bit because he wants to do he wants to have some kind of rebellion or war or something, you know, but. Pretty much like um, he, his servant explains that and so forth. And he did get beaten by someone that's called the Thunder Beast from the Wind Clan, I believe. And I believe that was Hawk right there. He got his butt whooped by Hawk. I, I'm just laughing hard because, yeah. But to be honest with you, he the guy might have been out of shape and so forth, if anything, you know. So, pretty much like overall, I really... I had my enjoyment in this episode a bit, but you know, like, um, at the end, Su Wong says he's gonna start a war, but it's just a war game, which is to the Earth Clan's, Earth, Earth, Earth Clan's leader disappoint me, <laughs> so I just go like, wow, dude, seriously, <laughs> like, you know, honestly, it, it's really, really hard for me to try to accept Su Wong as a freaking king, as a different king, like, the Earth Clan's, like, Earth Clan's leaders are, like thinking he might be worse than King Second. I'm thinking in my mind it could be, but you know I don't really know what he's planning exactly. Cause right now, like it's bothering the heck out of me of what is going on right now. Because he seems like he will restore the kingdom to the way it was, but 
to me, it feels like um, a di whole different story than that. It's difficult for me to comprehend or to even accept that he's the he's the king right now. So yeah, so that's what this episode about. You know, about ha maybe the first eight to nine minutes is about Yona and her group, and then the rest of it is just about Su Wan traveling around and so forth. So yeah, it's pretty sim it's pretty simple. I mean, like nothing new or crazy happening in other cases. Just being literal and honest. So that's about it. So. The episode was enjoyable. The op the new opening and ending was pretty nice. It's just like um, I am still kind of bothered about Su Wan being the new king. <laughs> I mean, come on, man! I expect some kind of malicious act, act like an act of evil or something that I will consider like um going to war or killing off some things, you know, that kind of thing. But this guy's like, how old is he? I don't know, eighteen, I believe, <laughs> and so forth. I just go like. Dear Lord, someone do something. That's all I can say. So, this episode's pretty basic a bit. Hopefully, it's... Next episode, saw the preview. I don't know what to expect, but... Hopefully, to get some fun out of it, hopefully. Well, don't know. But, I'm just going to end it here, people. I'm Alpha Zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you on my next video, right? Later. Peace out. Bye-bye.